Hey guys, I am in an awesome mood today. I don't know if it's because it's a three day weekend, Monday's Columbus Day and I am off. Or if it's because I was wicked productive today and I did like a whole deep clean in the kitchen, like legit fridge, microwave, tons of dishes, walls, like everything. Or if it's just because I'm going to film three back to back videos right now of some unboxings that I've been super excited for. So there's some sneak peeks behind you, specifically the cause box. I have a FabFitFun edit sale in front of me and I have my AIA bi-monthly. And the one I'm going to be doing right now for you guys is a small business through Etsy. It is called Sweet Bee Homemade Soaps. This is my second box from her. This one is also bi-monthly. It's not a subscription. You just purchase it as it releases. And this one is like a Halloween themed one because we are in October. So I always appreciate that there's like a special handling fragile sticker. There's one in the back. This is the back. That's why you can't see my address. And there's also one in the front here where my address is. And then she also put like a little thank you sticker. You guys know I love supporting small businesses. I worked for one for eight years. I see the hustle it takes firsthand to run your own business. You're supporting someone's dream. You're not putting money into a large corporation. I mean, I'm not going to say I don't buy from those stores. I do. But I definitely want to support um, small businesses. Get, guys, definitely consider looking into small businesses right now. Start buying gifts for Christmas. Help these people out, especially with what happened with COVID-19. A lot of businesses are being shut down and it really breaks my heart. So I had seen in a little sneak peek that the box was going to be orange this month uh, because of obviously Halloween. And I love the blue polka dot lettering. So cute. It says B box. You have a little B over here. B natural with the B. This is definitely a box I could see myself saving for storage it's super duper cute so let's open it up and there's a little sneak peek of what is inside and of course it already smells so good just like the last box doesn't surprise me at all so let's see there is a oh the sister stones i do not have anything from them but it is a small business candle company so i guess it's i'm gonna assume there's an item of hers in here and it says happy fall from the sister stone the sister stones.com and their egg is also sister stone so if you guys are interested i've heard that their smells are amazing oh, here it is the candle right here and it says the sister stoned scent PSL, which we all know is pumpkin spice latte. And it says it's cinnamon, ginger, nutmeg, orange peel, pumpkin, clove, black tea, vanilla, and graham cracker. That sounds so good. It even has the little three feet so it's not like directly on your furniture producing heat. And it talks about trimming the wick and the warning and all that. If you have pets, let's smell this. So it's a little lid. Oh, yes. Oh, my God. This smells like fall in a candle. It is definitely like pumpkin-y. You can smell the nutmeg, the cinnamon, the clove. Oh, wow. That smells incredible. I love candles like this um, in the kitchen or dining area because it, like, smells like food. Oh, and then in my apartment, the way it is, you walk in and it's the dining room and it opens into the kitchen. So, it's like you get that scent as soon as you walk into the house. Oh, super excited for this. So let's see, there's a little thing here that says thank you. And there's a bunch of stuff inside here. So let's see what this is. Open it up. Looks like a bunch of stickers, which I love stickers. If you guys watch this channel, you know I always buy some at Dollar Tree. Um, I incorporate them into my journals and my planners and i have been wanting to start bullet journaling again for january i mentioned that if you see those two boxes right there that is a haul up on my channel right now it was a michael's planners anonymous unboxing that came with beautiful stickers so there's this little um ladle spoon thing here i'm gonna guess it goes to an item in here. I know I've received these little things before when I get like body scrubs or bat salt. It helps you control like the serving size. I'm going to guess that that's what that's for. And the, yeah, it's a bunch of cute stickers. I love this one. It's like the map of the United States and it says travel. This one says no bad vibes. This one is a cute little heart. Could definitely see myself adding this some like, like I said, to my journaling, to my planners, to the cover of some notebooks, to my laptop. I love stuff like this. And then it even says, thank you for supporting my small business with her Instagram, Sweet Bee HMS, which stands for homemade soap. And it says scratch for a special surprise. Let's see if it's a discount code or something i have my 
handy dandy scissors and i'm gonna assume that's what it is this is such a cute little touch she does amazing things if you guys saw my last box it was a bar of soap that had a fortune inside i thought that was so different and so cute so it's five dollars off your next purchase of 25 or more use code five i wonder if this would work on a future box um i definitely think i'm getting december's um i i don't see myself disliking this box whatsoever um i know from already what i can see and the candle i already showed you super excited i think this was 32 dollars, and then i know i paid shipping so it was like 40 exactly this was a product she featured on Instagram. I was dying, dying to try this. So I'm so excited that it came in this box. It is the whipped rosemary soap. Can you guys see that? It literally looks like whipped cream in a jar. Like that must feel so good on your skin. It says it has shea butter, coconut oil, rosemary oil, oats, and water. And then it just has her Etsy shop, Sweet Bees HMS. And then it has her website and her Instagram. And it says, thank you. I, that might be what this little ladle thing is for. And I've heard it makes an amazing shaving cream as well. Yeah, you can definitely smell the rosemary. It's like even like a little greenish color. Oh my God, that is like so soft. It's like so bouncy as soon as you put your finger to it. Scooping this out. Oh my God, that's going to feel so good. I cannot wait to try that. This was an item. Like I said, if, I was waiting because if it didn't come in the box, I was going to purchase it to try it. So I'm glad I waited. And then I see one of her soaps, which is what she's known for. It is the Cucumber Melon Bar. That sounds like a really good combination. Ooh. Has fresh cucumber, fresh melon, sugar, cucumber melon oil, and coconut oil. And this one, I believe, even comes on a rope. Let's see. That's what it looks like. Once you open it, I see a little rope right here that is so cute i do have like a little hook in my bathroom where i hang stuff so i can definitely hang this on the hook and it looks like it has can you guys see that like a scrubber inside so as you get this wet and the soap melts down a little bit there's gonna be like a little exfoliation to that that is awesome cannot wait to try that and cucumber melon is definitely a very popular scent so super excited to receive that i've been using all her soaps um i know the last box too came with like a bunch of little sample sizes and my star box if, which you guys can see that's these little boxes right here um had a bunch of sample sizes from her i got a cute little glass jar from dollar tree added all the cute little sample size soaps and i have it like displayed in my bathroom and i take one out every once in a while and my skin has never felt better since using her products it's like all natural all organic so I, you really notice a difference with your skin and then this one comes in its own little like satin bag and it's not satin but whatever this is <laughs> and it's a uh, charcoal eucalyptus bar <laughs> you guys know if you've watched this channel you know i'm absolutely obsessed with charcoal i literally just ordered from a new skincare brand the other day i just filmed that unboxing yesterday it's called kate and co and i got a charcoal face scrub that i just used this morning and i was obsessed with it so this has active charcoal and eucalyptus oil and i love the smell of eucalyptus it's actually one of my favorite candles at bath and body oh yeah you can definitely smell it so this one even has like little ridges so that must feel so good rubbing that on your skin so i know my boyfriend's even really been liking her product so i can definitely Going to add that into my shower once I'm done with the one I'm on now. Ooh, okay. There is another bar of soap. This one is the Rose Bar. And it says it has sugar, rose petals, coconut oil, and rose water. And you can even see, like, how natural it is. You can see, like, the little rose buds. Hold on, let me open this so I can show you guys. The little rosebuds within the bar of soap and it just feels like so good on your skin honestly so you can see them all poking out and this side where it like settled you see tons of that and this smells so good oh my god like you can smell it as soon as you open the box you can read all the ingredients like there's no secret there's nothing you can't pronounce i will literally show it to you guys of course now it's ripped but that is it right there and it literally says sugar rose petals coconut oil and rose water like that is it same thing with the cucumber melon fresh cucumber melon oil sugar coconut oil like awesome okay let's see what else we got oh it's a little eye mask so i'm not gonna lie i don't use eye masks 
I have considered buying one I've seen that has like the hollowed out inside so you don't feel the pressure on your eyes and I have been considering getting that one because I have not been sleeping well since I returned back to work I don't think I've gotten a full night's sleep in a while I always tend to wake up in the middle of the night I don't know why I don't know if it's just like me adjusting to a new schedule or the stress because of everything going on. Me going back to work has been kind of nerve-wracking. I don't like the pressure of these on my eyes, but I can throw this in with someone's gift basket. I am making gift baskets this Christmas. This is super cute. I like the black and white for Halloween. She definitely went with a the theme. It says sweet dreams and I love it. It's like a little fairy on the moon with some stars and it just has the elastic string to wrap around your head i wonder if my boyfriend would like this i don't know if he's ever used anything like this but he never used a weighted blanket before me he would always be like oh that's gonna be way too hot for me and now he's obsessed um he's a really bad insomniac me i fall asleep quickly it's i have trouble like staying asleep him it takes him forever to fall asleep so i'll see if he likes that if not like i said you can throw it in a little gift basket that's what's perfect if it's something you don't like you can always add it into a gift basket and it's perfect especially with christmas being around the corner and then the last thing is in this box right here and it says wood karma boutique so let's open it up oh my god this is so cute halloween is a saturday this year i don't know if halloween's even happening but the friday before i'll obviously be going to work and we like last year i didn't wear like a full-on costume but i had like a cute shirt on that had like candy corns on it if i remember correctly um i do have a shirt this year that has like a skull on it i was planning on wearing that and i could definitely see myself rocking these on um the night before halloween at work and if i do go somewhere it definitely wouldn't be anything crazy but even my boyfriend just go like out to eat on a saturday night or go see my mom whatever these are super duper cute i could see myself wearing these like just all of october even with what i'm wearing right now like can you guys see that it's like a witch on her broom and this is like don't i'm not good with material so i can't tell you this can't be real wood because i feel like it'd be a lot heavier i don't know but that's what it looks like can you guys tell it looks almost like wood grain it but it is super super cute so that is everything inside the sweet bee homemade soap b box and like i said it is a bi-monthly box i can link my last box which was in august i had to think back for a second um down below if you guys are interested and like i said definitely consider supporting small businesses right now add them to christmas gifts and uh, it really makes a difference in someone's life. I can tell you her personally. She messages me all the time on Instagram. She watches my stories. There's days where I have like bad news or good news. And she always responds. She's very sweet. I know my first box they were doing a t-shirt. And it only went up to extra large. And I am way more than an extra large. This is a 4X. So um, I messaged her and I asked her if she could... Um, take out the shirt and substitute it for something else and i even said if you can't it's totally fine my boyfriend can wear it. or well, i was even thinking i can cut it um because i can't wear an extra large if i if it's a crop top like if i don't want it to sit on my hips because i am very like hippie and thigh -y. um if i only want it to be short then the extra large is fine i'm not very heavy on top so but she was very accommodating she said right away that she could switch the shirt for me that it was no problem at all so uh it's that's what i like working about small businesses they really appreciate the customers that they have they usually always go above and beyond i've always gotten like cute stickers with my order or a free little extra gift or anything like that so this is definitely a small business that is worth supporting any small business really is worth supporting definitely consider it for this holiday season that is it for this box if you enjoyed this unboxing give the video a thumbs up it really helps with my youtube algorithm uh definitely comment below is this something you'd be interested in um would you consider getting this box do you plan on shopping small business for christmas i always like interacting with you guys and that is it guys be safe